before I get straight into this video, I'm gonna need every single person, every single person that clicks on this video, yes, you, the nigga that's currently watching the video right now, yes, you, I'm gonna need you to go ahead and hit that like button, bro. I don't know why you're still sitting here watching me eat mode walking down the, the road right now. Nah. <laughs> Go ahead and hit that like button, Smeet Head. Go ahead and hit the like button, bro. Also, I'm going to need y'all to follow my social medias. Go ahead and follow Instagram if you ever want to chat it up with me. And go ahead and follow me on Twitter because I'll be on Twitter posting more clips and stuff like that for y'all boys. So, from here on out, I'll always have a video on Wednesday and Sunday. Wednesdays and Sundays at 8 p.m., bro. Everybody needs to keep up with me on Instagram and Twitter. Y'all boys, go ahead and follow that, bro. I don't know why you're still sitting here and you still haven't followed me on Instagram or Twitter. Go ahead and follow me on that, bro. <laughs> Anyways, y'all see the title, bro. Y'all see the title of the video. I will be giving y'all my Grimlock, my Grim Reaper build, my Grim Lock build, my Lock build, my ISO Lock build for this year. Y'all know every year I play ISO and I'm also the lock on the team. You you, you guys know this already. You guys know that I always make a ISO that can always play defense. And before, this is your fair warning right now, before you make my build, bro, before you make my ISO build, before you make my lock build, I'm you, you need to watch the full video, bro, because some people are going to mess up and I hate when YouTubers release videos and, and have people me messing up their builds because that's not their play style, bro. Like, honestly, bro. I'm going to give y'all the tips and tricks on how to make your perfect build in 2K. So stay tuned for all that. I don't want the intro to be too long, y'all. Y'all go ahead and grab y'all snacks. Sit back, relax. And let's go ahead and get straight into this intro. Now, before I get straight to the builder, I don't know what the hell is going on with Mike Wing. <laughs> I don't know what the hell is going on with Ronnie. Ronnie, please, I hope you're watching this video right now. They seem to always nerf ISOs every single year. They always nerf dribblers. Dribblers, I promise you, are nerfed every single year when it comes to adrenaline, moving, just slow movement, just certain things of that nature, bro. Everything is always nerfed for the dribbler so this is a this is a fair warning for the 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 iso this year the movement in park is not what you are seeing right now the movement in park is not what you see right now it is way slower your movement is way slower than what you're seeing right now right now this is some of my six right now in park yes i'm still moving fast these are my six i'm still moving fast not to say i don't move fast but it is not as fast as you think it is. Trust me when I say that. Trust me when I say that. I have an 80 win percentage and above every single year, bro. I know what I'm talking about. You want a very, if you want to be ISO, bro, you need a very, very high speed with ball. Very, very high ball handle. Lock in, y'all. Lock in. Because y'all really not locked into what I'm saying right now. The movement is slow. And the defense is very buffed. When I tell you, you can get boxed by a 6'2 with no defense this year. The, the defense is really overpowered. I'm trying to tell y'all. The 6'2 that I'm playing right now, the 6'2 with the yellow boots, bro, I promise you, he can clamp people with no, absolutely no defense. I literally, a two-year-old, a two-year-old can get on the sticks right now and play good defense. I promise you that's how overpowered defense is this year. Now, not to say it won't change later on because this is obviously before patch one, right? So as of right now, currently in the current game, the defense is over overpowered now y'all see me sigging up bro y'all see y'all y'all see the six bro y'all see the six though y'all see the six bro y'all see the six if y'all want a video on the six if y'all want a video on the six bro get this video to 200 likes or 150 I, I, i'll do 150 likes if this video gets to 150 likes i'll drop my six if not if the video doesn't get to 150 likes best believe my my six will not be released <laughs> My SIGs will not be released. You will actually have to pull up on me in park to actually get my SIGs. Because if y'all don't know this year, people can look at your SIGs like on your uh, player card. People can actually go to your player card and look at all your SIGs that you have. So y'all just gonna have to do that if y'all, if the video doesn't get 250 likes. 
let's go ahead and get straight into the builder now that y'all know that defense is very very overpowered it's very overpowered mike wing we need to tone it down a little bit why can my little brother has never played 2k before come into 2k and play some damn defense why is a 6-2 able to box me on the perimeter somebody tell me what's going on mike wing i need i need i need an explanation like but anyways y'all see the builder bro we're on the builder now right so point guard 6'6 199 pounds bro don't ask me why i did that at the time but it's 199 pounds right y'all want to go 73 wingspan and have it automatically just 99 stamina bro for for a guard for for a for iso you need a 99 stamina bro for vert you want to go exactly 70 vert bro 70 vert and you always want to make sure your strength is at a 63 minimum 63 strength minimum as an iso guard bro because you get that blow by you get the blow by uh that blow by badge acceleration you want to go 86 right 86 is minimum and then for speed you want to go 86 minimum so once you get the physicals down bro go straight to defensive rebound bro every single iso that i see that doesn't have a rebound i'm already knowing their ass i'm already knowing their trash at iso because every single iso knows with iq we always play and have a higher rebound than most guards right we always have them we always have a higher rebound than most guards you don't want to touch the defensive rebound you want to go block 80 fully all the way up now notice y'all notice how i didn't touch my steel i want y'all to really pay attention notice how i didn't touch my steel right for me personally as my iso i never go for steals i always play stick i always play good stick i always play in this 2k you will not be able to have every stat overpowered you are not going to have a, a a fully okay. overpowered demigod build this year it's just not what it is so we have to sacrifice something i chose me personally to sacrifice my steel because i already play stick also like i said before the defense is very very overpowered bro you can quite literally have no defense on your player and and be good at defense i'm letting y'all know that now now look y'all i upgraded my perimeter to a 93 because if you think about it if the defense is already overpowered imagine you having all gold badges for a lock bro imagine you having gold clamps 94 feet you get that hall of fame y'all Yo, you're you're basically a pure you're basically a pure lock bro you're basically a pure lock that the defense is already overpowered so imagine having a high perimeter defense bro that's all you really need to clamp somebody to be honest and then you want to have that 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 decent enough interior to guard small guards or guard people that's trying to slash because all guards and all people that are making builds nowadays are not finna have dunk like that they're finna have more of a driving layup and that shit's getting clamped if you have a good interior or a mid interior which is 75 for me now y'all can choose to actually lower your defense if you wanted to you can choose to lower your defense and make your offense better because the defense like i said is very overpowered right i just chose to have my defense more like this because i want to be more like a lot y'all want to instantly go 92 ball handle 75 bro let me tell you this right now if you have below a 75 pass accuracy as an iso anyway you, you're you're cut you don't need to be making any type of iso build you don't even know how to even what are you doing right now bro what do you click off the video if you have lower than a 75 pass accuracy go ahead and click off the video want to go ahead and make that speed with ball at 83 so you can get that gold blow by blow by is a really good badge this year y'all a really good badge y'all want to go ahead and make that at 83 now look y'all really lock in y'all not really locked for y'all not locked for real bro y'all not really locked for real bro i need y'all to really lock in when i say this bro when you are upgrading y'all threes bro there is this thing called it's shooting slump right there's this thing that it's going it's, it's it's blowing up all over twitter there's this thing called shooting slump where one game you will dead series go three for three you will go three for three to four for four on the three-point line but then the very next game you will go one for 17 so if you are making a build that has a lower three ball and i mean the 80 below at 85 without limitless range if you have a below listen lock in if you have a below 85 three ball just know you are most likely going to struggle more than most people to shoot you're going to shoot around 40 percent if that man my fucking shooting slumps in fucking stupid fucking game i'm tired of this fucking shit and stupid slumps i'm tired of this fucking bitch and fucking game man defense <laughs> 
that boy Nade, that boy Nade was going crazy, bro. I ain't gonna lie, that boy was finna cry. But nah, dead serious. Like that's that's really how you feel. That's really how you feel whenever you get into the shooting slump, bro. When you get into that shooting slump and you and you you're going one for eighteen and, and one for twenty, bro, and you can't shoot. And Nade had Nade Nade had a ninety nine three. I want y'all to really lock in. He had a ninety nine three point. Imagine me with an eighty three point. You get what I'm trying to say? So I'll be passing the ball more and dunking the ball more more so than just scoring and, and shooting the ball so it's more of a pass the ball type play style this year the bigs i play with will have a higher three ball than 85 because i'm not gonna lie to you if my big misses it's ggs bro it's it's game over bro it's it's ggs we lost we lost the game if i can't shoot and my big can't shoot it's ggs this year i'm more of a pass first pass first iso lock and to finish off this lock build bro y'all want to go ahead and max your uh, your driving dunk at 75 and the layup is already overpowered at a 70 so I just gave it the extra two points, the 72 driving layup, bro. And you will end up with a two-way three-point shot creator, bro. Yes, I know it's the, the build name is kind of from last year, bro. But it, it, it's a little bit different this year, y'all. The, the play style is a little bit different this year. The shooting, you're going to have to get used to it. The shooting slumps, you're going to have to get, you're going to have to work around the shooting slumps. And the movement, when I tell y'all, listen to me again, when I tell y'all this, <laughs> the movement okay. is not how it used to be. The movement is not as fast as you think it is, bro. So if you don't have a bag, if you don't have a bag this year and you can't really ISO, then don't make this build, bro. Do not make this build. Do not make this build if you cannot actually ISO this year, bro. And wait, hold on a second. Who is who is short? Who is this? Who is is she wearing tight? Is she wearing tidy whities walking around in the street? Ronnie, like keep it PG, keep it PG. But look, hold on. Let me let me talk to you. Let me talk. Can you stop? Can I talk to you? Can I talk to you? Can I talk to you, gang? So 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 you're not gonna stop. You're not gonna stop. All right. <laughs> if I made y'all chuckle, giggle, smile. Or if y'all even learned a little bit of information this entire video, I'm going to need y'all to hit that like button. Go ahead and join the clan. Go ahead and hit that sub button also, bro. Like I said in the intro, for the next two months, three months, I will be posting every Wednesday and every Sunday. Just make sure you are on the lookout every single every single Sunday at 8 p.m. and every single Wednesday at 8 p.m. Always be on the lookout for my videos, y'all. And I'm going to reiterate one more time. Reiterate one more time for the bots, for the NPCs. For the casual players that don't understand what I'm what I say by do not make this build if you do not know how to really ISO. If you don't have a bag, if you do not have a bag, or if you are not an ISO off rip, do not make this build. Especially if you want to make this build, do not make it with a low three ball, bro. I promise you, the shooting slumps are going to get you off your game, bro. I prom I promise you. I promise you, you are going to struggle with an 83 ball. It is not how it used to be in every other year, bro. You cannot just shoot with a low three ball this year. Now, this is also before patch one. That's also a disclaimer. This is also before patch one. So, if anything else changes, I'll give y'all updates on the builder myself. And I do not sugarcoat anything, bro. If something's trash, I'm not like these other YouTubers. If something's really trash, I will not make it for y'all. I will not make it for y'all. Now, all that being said, bro, everything being said, I hope y'all enjoyed today's video, man. Hope I made some of y'all's day because that is my job as a content creator. It's always to make y'all smile and just make y'all's day. So, all that being said, y'all have a very, very, very blessed day and uh, <laughs> peace.